You gotta swing my way, but don't believe that, babe. I'm all shady, so don't believe that, babe. Hi, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. I'm leaving you guys not already. Welcome back to another day of vlogging. So, I'm about to go to lunch. Some crazy shit just happened to me. She ran into my house. So, the whole front of my house, not the whole front, but my, she ran into the fireplace. So, the wood, my chimney, fucked off. And that is what's going on right now. I'm hungry, I'm irritated, I'm disappointed. Not disappointed, but I'm just irritated. Like, I don't know how to feel. Like, they say that it's okay for me to still live there. But, like, what? Like, what am I, what you mean it's okay for me to still live there? Like, what am I supposed to do? Like, I mean, not that anything's damaged, like my room. Only thing that's damaged for real is the fireplace, like that's it. Everything else is fine. But why do I, I don't want to stay there with all that stuff like that. Like the fuck, like I don't know. I don't know what to do. I, I, do y'all know this is my first apartment. When shit like this happens, I don't even know what the next step is. Do I get some free rent? So do I get to move into a new unit? Cause they starting to remodel, we have new owners. So they're starting to remodel the place, but apparently the two units that are like done and new, they're they're already pre-leased. So I don't think it's given that I'm getting a new unit, but what can be done? Because I had nothing to do with this. I was in the, the room doing my dark hair. So yeah, you guys, I don't, I don't know. I don't know, but I'm gonna keep you guys updated. Welcome to another day of vlogging. Okay, y'all, so look, this is what the inside looks like. So, the whole fucking, whole fucking fireplace fucked up. But nothing was, nothing of mine was damaged, for real. My mirror's still standing. I'm, I usually keep my freaking laptop, so I'm happy, like, nothing flew on my laptop. It's a brick on my couch. But, yeah. So, it's later. To be honest, what just happened today? I don't even know how to feel. Like my whole day, like my whole day was just kind of turned upside down, and it wasn't because of something I did. So it's just like a weird feeling. And I literally like, I don't know. I didn't eat today. I didn't have no. I'm sorry. I'm trying to set this up. I didn't eat today. I don't I didn't have any coffee today. I feel crazy. Like I was just in the middle of just getting Mari ready and then just like this happened. So now I'm, fin I'm finna eat. So I'm fin I'm about to try chorizo for the first time. I've never had this my whole life. So I'm finna see where it's in for. I wish I had sour cream. Okay. Okay, okay. I'm excited. I'm just excited to eat. Like, I don't know. I feel, I just feel weird. Like, I, I can't really describe it. But they said that they're gonna cover it. Well, can you turn it down a little bit? Jay. Oh. Um, they said they're gonna cover it with plywood and stuff today. So, that's the best they can do right now. It's still livable for me to be here, so I'm sure they're gonna fix it pretty fast because they've been getting stuff done fast. I don't know because this is like brick and shit. I don't, I don't know what's gonna happen, but I know for tonight that's what's gonna happen. But anywho, let's try the burrito. And sorry if I sound weird if I'm vlogging with. I told y'all I'm real jittery and just I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but I'm gonna try it. It's pretty good. I don't know if I would get it again, but I probably would. But it's good. Like, I'm not like oof, blown away. But like, it's good. I'll eat this. So, I'm about to just relax. <laughs> um, Later on, we're going to 
a light show. My mama bought tickets for this little light show. And we're gonna go to that. And yeah. I'm sorry, y'all. I can't vlog right now. I just feel, I don't know. <laughs> okay, you guys. So it's a lot. Watch out, baby. It's a lot later. But the people are here. Watch out, but Mar. Don't walk up on that. They're here. And no. Thank you. you. Just put everything on top of there. But yeah, so they're here and they're cleaning up everything. So they're gonna put plywood on the inside and outside just to make sure that nothing gets in the house because it's supposed to get really cold tonight. So yeah, now that they're doing that, Mari, back up, <laughs> back up, baby. <laughs> Get up, baby. So they're getting all of the um, brick and stuff out of here. So yeah, so that's what's going on. I'm just happy that something's gonna be done so that I don't have to leave my house. Like I really don't want to go to a hotel. Like everyone is like, well, you can come stay over here, or I don't want to do none of that. I want to stay where the fuck I pay rent at. <laughs> I don't want to go to no hotel. I don't want to pack up no bags. I don't want to pack up Mars. I want to be at home. I'm off today. I want to be home. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what I got going on. Um, thank God that my heater and everything works. So I'm not cold. Like, it's nothing socks in a onesie cannot solve. You know, the my my room is far from the fireplace in the living room. So all I have to do is close my door and I'll be hot in here. I don't care how cold it is outside. So my heat works is just fine. I'm fine, Mari's fine. I'm just happy that, you know, everyone's okay. No one was in the living room. Mari, come here. Come here. It's okay, but you can't go in there with them. So yeah, I'm literally, I'm, she wanna, you know, go up over there. So yeah, I'm just happy that, you know, nobody, no one was in the living room. Like my sister, my best friend, my baby was here. Like everyone was here. And well, they came afterwards. No, they came during. Whatever. Just happy no one was hurt in this. And I saw the lady, y'all. Y'all, she started crying. She apologized. She said she was on pills. And she said something happened with her niece. It just haven't been a good holiday season for her. And she was like, just happy and apologized. She, she was like, I could have killed y'all. She said she fell asleep behind the wheel on the way here. And then when she got here, she was just out of you. So like I said, bitch, she was high. <laughs> and yeah. I, but I'm really pissed off though. I don't know what I should do or if I should ask for anything because like I was using my fireplace and now that's a portion of my rent that I'm not using. <laughs> so what? I don't know. I doubt they're gonna do anything about that. But it's like yeah, I just I, I don't know. Like I was using my fireplace and it's cold and it's just like I'm just confused on what <laughs> like I know that like my apartment is still livable and stuff like that, but at the end of the day that's not how I got my units. That's one of the things that I liked about this place is that it had a fireplace. So I'm just a little confused and a little flustered about what to do with that. But yeah, sorry at the beginning or this portion of the vlog was weird. I don't know, like my brain, it was just, I don't know. It's just, I, I couldn't think straight. And then it's like, you know when you do something, you're thinking about, what I gotta do, what's the next step? But it's like, I don't know the next step. I don't know what I have to do. This never happened to me before. I cannot believe someone drove into my home. <laughs> like, I, I don't know who to call. Like, I, I'm not supposed to call anyone. Like, I had to talk to police and stuff like that. Like, it was just too much for me. And I don't know, it had my brain feeling weird. And I still feel kind of weird, but I don't know. I'm probably gonna go to the gym or something tonight. I'm not sure, but I gotta get this energy off because I have to go to work tomorrow. Um. But yeah. Huh? I'm gonna I'm gonna get some. But yeah. Um just, yeah, I'll check back in with y'all when something new is going on. So yeah. I'm like so excited. I wish I could tell y'all the excitement, but it's just a little, it's a little personal, so I can't tell you, but just know. <laughs> but just know. We shall overcome. Girl, filled with excitement. Okay, but yeah, so I just got off work. Um, My makeup look crazy in this lighting. But yeah, I just got off work. 
uh, not too long ago. I went to Target to get some towels and some body wash and some deodorant because I was out. Um. Um. And now I'm in my friend's house because she texted me. She was like, I think you should come over after all. I let me go back. <laughs> what? I'm so excited. So I'm in my friend's house because she was like, I think you should come over after work. I got liquor and I got gumbo. You ain't said nothing but a word, miss. I feel like y'all can't see me. You ain't said nothing but a word, miss. So that is where I'm at. I'm just in the car talking to y'all before I go up in there. I look crazy. This lighting, this makeup is just not giving. Anyways, but yeah, that's where I'm at. Finna get it. And I bought me a jacket today too, y'all. Girl, I went to work and it was like maybe 50 degrees. I got out of work. It was 24. Everyone was like, um, you didn't buy, she said, if you didn't bring nothing, uh, no jacket or nothing, you better buy one. I'm like, bitch, I do. Like, I literally dead ass had to buy a jacket because, like, it was freezing outside. I had my toes out. I was slipping with my toes out. I went home to change or whatever. And yeah. So I've never tried eggnog before. Cause growing up, I don't like milk. Still don't like milk. So eggnog, I just thought it was milk. No. <laughs> but I, I'm a grown woman. Look at my friend Braid. I'm a grown woman now. Came out. And my uh taste buds have matured. Bring y'all down, huh? My taste buds have matured. So I'm like, let me try some eggnog. And this is a friend that well, no matter what she make or suggest, it's gonna be good in my eyes. So, well, we in my mouth. This shit together, though, so let's just be clear. <laughs> I don't want no false hope. So, so, oh yeah. So she made me a little glass. Let's see. Is it good? Mm. Is it? It tastes like a, a melted cake. A liquid that one cake. has three different liquors in it. Brandy, whiskey, uh, yeah, this got liquor in it too. bourbon, I believe. Interesting. It's, it's, it's giving that. Mm. It's actually good. Mm -hmm. I fuck with that. You ever had an espresso martini? No, but I would love to try it. You should try it. I think I don't think, I don't I think it's do is a chocolate martini. I'm not I don't think it's drink. a good dinner drink personally, mm -hmm. but like brunch, if you don't want to do mimosa, oh, it's perfect. Hmm. In my opinion, I don't. I wouldn't get that this as my dinner cocktail. Like it's just it's too sweet. It's like coffee with your stuffed chicken. It's just not giving. <laughs> my girl gonna always give me some whipped cream. You need to get them. I'm, I'm gonna find them whip shots and give them to you. I have some. For real? In Austin. I need to find some. You would love that. Yes, I would. I like whipped cream. You, you do. Chocolate, I will tell you right now. I don't really too much care for my whipped Yeah, I will get you vanilla for I sure. Like I'm, I'm enough chocolate myself. <laughs> That's what. I ain't gonna ever right, bitch. But yeah, you guys, it was a great day today. I went to work. Work was pretty slow though. For it, it's the twenty, what's that? Twenty second? The twenty second is like, yes. yeah, like three days before Christmas, and everywhere else was pretty busy. But for my counter, it wasn't too busy because we sold out of everything. Like literally, we sold out of everything. Yeah. There's no, <laughs> there's no like gift sets. Like all the good holiday gift sets that's, that's like online, we don't have nothing. So it wasn't really much for me to do because literally our drawers are empty. Like a lot of shit is gone. So pretty chill day i was at work by myself too so yeah another day another shift that's how it's been this entire vlog y'all already know you need help with that rice <laughs> y'all this is the jacket i bought today i look big as hell in it with this hoodie on it is the perfect blend it's like and it's still strong yes this is good as fuck i like this a lot i wish i could tell them the good news but it's like right. it's, it's personal so i don't want to right and they involve other people but bitch just know this drink cheers to me to fucking me hey Coco Alicia. what you got on this dog y'all look at her dog <laughs>
<laughs> oh, rescue. <laughs> A rescue dog coat. <laughs> it's girl. the tail for me. Girl, it's, Coco. Cold. it's cold for her, girl. Oh, yeah, Mike, you gotta protect your girl. Period. One nigga don't want to come home to you. <laughs> Get out. This bitch said I can see my legs. <laughs> no, bitch, we really are knocking on 30. Like, you know how, like, I used to be hella flexible. I still am, but that shit, it hurt. It ain't it's just, it ain't as smooth as it used to be, girl. That shit, ooh, it's a stretch for sure. Yeah, I got my gumbo. <laughs> ah! Don't play. What's today? Thursday. Today's been a great Thursday. Hey, y'all. So, next day, girl, it's Christmas Eve, and I'm just running around. I just left Target because I need some leggings because of what I might wear for Christmas tomorrow. And I don't have no clean leggings. <laughs> and the ones that are clean got holes in them. It's just not going to work. <laughs> so, yeah, girl. Y'all know Target and Walmart are two different places. When I tell you, you can tell us it's giving Christmas Eve. And you know, Target, well, Target finna close in maybe about 20 minutes now. But, you know, people was on their last minute shit. Because, baby, I didn't see people that I ain't never seen before in Target. <laughs> Just, you know, the vibe wasn't giving Target tonight. But, you know, we all had to get our shit done. Um, so, yeah. And then I saw... And then last night, I'm trying to hold y'all as I go. I'm going through this parking lot because it's just too much traffic up here. So I'm cutting through the parking lot. But um, I saw last night uh, somebody went to like a Christmas cocktail party. And I'm finna like try to mimic one of the cocktails that I saw one of the girls make. So hopefully it come out good. I don't have exactly everything that she um, had. But some of the stuff I feel like if I put it all together, it'd be cute. Um, I'm craving... Like, one, I'm hungry, like, for food, food, so I don't know what I'm eating tonight, but I'm craving Patron. Like, Patron used to be my bitch. Like, I used to be a Patron mommy. Like, that's how I got my ease my way into the tequila world was Patron. And, baby, I love Patron. Like, y'all know things is trending, Casamigos, and all of that is, you know, whatever. But Patron is, that used to be my girl, girl. And no one talks about Patron Reposado. Patron Reposado is tea, okay? So, I'm gonna go to the liquor store. They close and maybe a little hour and a half or so so i'm gonna go to the liquor store i think it's open when i checked my gps everything was still open and i said christmas may affect the hours but i feel like liquor stores know everyone's trying to get their little last little one too so they i know that they open for, trying to make their money type shit so hopefully i can um give me some patron because that is what i want okay i'm not listening to nobody i'm not feeling peer pressure to drink nothing else i'm gonna drink what i want to drink either that or hennessy like i just that's what i want today tonight and tomorrow i want i want that so yeah we're on a mission to the, uh go to the liquor store to get that and then we're gonna take it home and then i'm gonna figure out what i'm eating tonight so yeah i don't know about that i want to go see like some lights like maybe oh oh crashed <laughs> i want to go see some lights wait no wait that way that way i want to go see some lights <clears throat> But I don't know when that closes because it's like Christmas. I don't know when that closes. Or I want to go like to a neighborhood maybe to go see some lights. I don't know. But I think that I'm going to figure out some type of Christmas vibes tonight. Either that. I bought some Christmas cookies. So I made some Christmas cookies. Mari is with her dad. So she's not with me for this holiday season. Um, The way like I should have set up mostly she's not with me on holidays. Well... I only been a mom for two years. So last year she was with me for the holidays. This year she wasn't. No. How did it go? Last year she wasn't with me for the holidays. This year. No. She be with her daddy uh, Thanksgiving. And then she be with me. But this year she with her daddy Christmas. Yeah. So year two but of course i'm gonna go see her and stuff tomorrow because i just can't like not see my baby on the holiday but uh as far as christmas eve we are kid free caring so i may link up with my sister like i don't know what what is given what i'm gonna do but i'm just updating you guys and i'm tired of holding this camera like i need a car mount i'm too grown to not have a car mount like this what I'm doing is ghetto and it, it hurts my arm and it just takes a lot out of me. But yeah, I'm trying to find me a liquor store. I know that little liquor store, that TJ liquor store closed down. So I'm trying to see. I know it's one like right by my house. 
So I'm just trying to see if I if that one's open, if they got some good shit. Because that's the thing. It's like liquor stores be open, but do they have the good shit? But I know for sure. I want to get Patron. So I'm on a hunt to find that. Liquor store closing like a little over an hour. So I got over an hour to find me some Patron. My phone is on 4%. I have no charger. But you know, it's fine. I know where I'm at. We vibing. But yeah, you guys. Um, oh, and I ordered me a new computer charger like today. It says it'll be here on the 28th. Might come earlier. I think it's just saying that because just predicting Christmas. But might come earlier. So whenever I get my charger, I can get the content back to y'all. But I'm still just continuing to vlog because, you know, why not? I should have turned. Is there a liquor store down here, though? Good morning, you guys. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Girl, I'm tired. I ain't gonna lie. I'm getting ready right now for church. I'm going to church with my mom and my sister. Um, I'm not putting on no makeup. It's, it's a no for that. But I'm just wearing this white bodysuit from Fashion Nova. Black leggings. And then I might wear this red blazer. I don't know. You know, give a little holiday cheer. giving you know candy cane with some black boots i haven't worn a blazer in forever and it's like it shows i just feel like i don't know how to wear them anymore girl i've had this blazer since high school and i have not worn it since high school but i found it the other day and i was like hmm, i feel like i should throw this away then my friend was like no you just never know you know you must okay. you're right i don't know <laughs> I just, blazers used to be my thing. Like, blazers were my thing in high school. I feel like now that I'm grown, unless this just don't fit that well, like, it's small. Because I have had it for a long time. Like, But I just feel like now, blazers make me feel bulky. Excuse my bed, too. I didn't make it. I just got out of it. Um, yeah, blazers make you feel bulky. So, I don't know. I don't know about... I mean, it really don't matter, girl. I'm, I'm going to church, girl. <laughs> like, you know, it's not that deep. So I think I might wear this. And it's freezing outside, so definitely gonna need the extra layer coverage. I wish I had a scarf um, that I really set it off. But I'm just finish off my skincare and really get ready to head out because, yeah, it's really time to get ready to go. I'm gonna put on some of my good molecules. Super peptide serum. Can you see it? No, it's okay. Put a little bit of this one. My edge control is in my purse. So it's giving. I might um do my edges in the car. How is this flying? I'm trying to care a little bit though, cause the church I go to, child, that hoe is local, okay? Local. <laughs> you go see somebody you know. But that's the thing about us being grown now. We don't speak, child. Or if we speak, I feel like we in real close proximity to speak to each other. Hey, girl. And keep pushing. But back then, it's always, so I always see somebody I know at this church. So I'm trying to care a little bit, you know. I, ain't going to, I heard Walgreens is open today, even though it's. Christmas day. I heard Walgreens is open today. I need to go get me some lashes. Like, okay, I don't need to, but I want to. So I can feel pretty. Okay, you guys. I'm back home from church. Turn this on. Okay. <laughs> so my mama got me a gift, and it's pretty big. And I don't know what it is. I have no clue what it is. I don't know what I want. Very my... nice, Jessica. I don't know what in my life, I don't know in my life what I want this to be. I don't know in my life what I want this to be. I think I know what it is. So. <laughs> I got it. I, yeah. I, I have a gift card. I had an extra gift card today. Yeah, that's fine. So, I'll, I'll give it to her. So that, that gift card is sticking out right there. Open it. I am. You know what it is? And then I'll give you yours layer too to give okay. to Sarah. But it's a, it's something thick though, because I see the name. Stand by the heater. I'm dead. Mama, you got it. Oh, I know you mad. 
I'm no, sorry. No, no. <laughs> Yo, she got Aww. me the big big case. Aww, thank what's you. Big, what's the big big case for? But like, whenever I do weddings and, and like travel for like, it's multiple people. This is a big big case. I don't, I'm not gonna lie, mama. This is a big big case. I don't think. I, well, I don't know. I'm not you gonna don't say. Know. You don't know how much. That but is. baby, this this is OD. <laughs> yeah. So for the future weddings, you gonna have a bunch of clients, ho. Look how big this is, y'all. Girl, you ready to go. <laughs> but I gotta tell y'all some bad news, though, which is why I kinda, I don't feel a way about this gift, but it's just, it's awkward. See, I remember when I told y'all I had my, that wedding on New Year's, she canceled on me, y'all. So, she made some arrangements, and I was arranged out. <laughs> but, I'm still very grateful, because there will be more. But, yeah. yeah sure. Oh, but like, you don't have to take all of this, so I could like take some parts yeah. yeah. Like, I don't have to take all of it at once. Yeah. I see that too. And you, you can hide, you can hide stuff from Mari. Yeah. Yeah, that's another thing. Yeah, yeah, this is like, that's crazy. Like, like, well, at least like for your, like their clients, you can have that completely separate. In. Yeah. And then it comes with a little thing so I can roll it. Oh, thank you, Mom. I'm so, I'm so happy. I love it. Yeah, that's your actual, actual face. I have more and more clients. Right. More and more things. So, and it was one less thing that you have to buy. Yeah. Yeah, one less thing you have to buy. But, yeah, yeah, I don't know where my Christmas spirit is this year. Um, I've been watching other vlogs too, and a lot of people feel the same way. I just don't know where it is. Am I hungry? Like, I don't know what it is. I'm just, even, even, yeah, I, even church wasn't giving like that. Like, and I love Jesus. So, I don't know, y'all. But I think I'm finna just say this. Chill oh, here, well, take a nap, three pairs of shoes, and I'm thinking I'm, Bye. but yeah, I'm just trying to chill my mama bed for a little bit, take a nap. I, I ain't gonna be able to take a nap because we finna get up in a, in a little bit. It's not no nap gonna be taken, but I'm just chilling here. Then I'm gonna go see my nieces and stuff. Then I'm gonna go back home, probably go see Mars. I'm not sure. I guess I'm just thinking like. Like, me and my sister was talking the other day. When you work retail, the holidays is a blur sometimes to you. Because you're literally working every single day up until Christmas. And then, like, the day after Christmas, you're back there, back with the crowds. So, it's just like, like even though it's a holiday, it's my off day. But I'm, not, I'm trying not to be like that. It's not, I'm not the Grinch. I don't want to be the Grinch. I'm not trying to be the Grinch because I love Christmas. I don't... I just don't know what's what's up with my mood today. Like my mood today is just off. I don't know. I don't know. I just feel like something missing. So yeah, it's probably my baby, low key. For being honest, I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, y'all. I'll check back in probably when I get to my sister house or whatever. I had three hours. Of, I had three hours of sleep. I was really tired. And I don't know, I just had a bad attitude, but I called my baby and I had like a 15 minute nap. I stole this shirt from my daddy. And I'm in a bad mood now. So we're at my sister's house and we're about to go in, we're about to eat. Um it's a pop it's a pasta Christmas this Christmas, so yeah. <gasps> we should meet the marinara and the fish. They do I know she's Now 
can't you can't touch you the only thing you can touch is your plate. You can't touch your marshmallows, Mel. I'm trying not to. I'm trying. <laughs> you got it. You got it. The wine got me a little lit, but now it's time to get home. Where I'm home now. Hold on, y'all. Time with the kids was great. <clears throat> but now we're back home. We're gonna have, you know, adult fun. <laughs> because it's still early. It's only 7.40. So, we had pasta at my sister's house. But we didn't take them to home because I didn't want it. But it was really good. Um, I just didn't want that because I knew I was gonna make something here. So, we got chicken. We got... Mashed potatoes, no, not mashed potatoes, chicken, macaroni, yams, and Brussels sprouts. And I was trying to get some rolls, but they were sold out. So, refrigerator, the noise, they were sold out. So, I don't know what we're gonna do for our bread, but it's croissants in there, so we could probably do something with that. But yeah, Christmas at the kids' house was really cute. We, me and Jessica, got a little emotional <coughs> at the end because it's like, girl, like another Christmas with our parents you know like we're getting older and y'all know people our parents are getting older like family is passing away so anybody that was not in the Christmas spirit because I know I was not and my attitude earlier today is way different than how I was like now but anybody that's not feeling the spirit or I know boy this goes up holidays will be over but I'm just sending love and light your way because I know this is not the best time for everybody so yeah you got anything to say <laughs> but yeah we just chilling right now i started the yams already because that's gonna take probably the longest maybe mm. but in a minute the drink finna get flowing oh and i found a um a christmas cocktail that i'm gonna make for y'all too i've never tried it but i'm gonna try it tonight i'm gonna taste it so yeah that's on the menu as well i need to come up with a name so when i come up with a name for it I'll let y'all know. But I was just checking in, let you guys know what's going on, how Christmas is going so far. What happened? I know, she's so cute. <laughs> but yeah. Okay, you guys. So this is actually take two. I'm finna redo the drink because my camera's about to die and I kinda was rushing. I need to use the shot glass so I can have proper like measurements of shit. So we got Reposado tequila. We got different tequilas. I have Patron Reposado. If y'all never tried Patron Reposado, try it. Good as fuck. Patron Reposado, we got Terramina, and we also have Casamigos. But Casamigos is over there because we're playing the game, and we're taking shots with that. So, yeah. Should I do two shots? I'm gonna do two shots. And then, so the juice. We have Cran Pineapple. And I had to chill the stuff a little more too, so it could be, you know, colder. And we have white cran peach. And this the last of a shot of. Okay. And then we shake it. Y'all, I'm using this Starbucks cup because I don't have no shake. <laughs> okay. Let me pour this. So I had cranberries on the top. So I'm pour this. Oh, it's a little fizzier too. Period. Because Santa's favorite. And then he topped it. <laughs> Okay, then you top it with champagne. Yo, that was crazy. Things gonna just sh shoot at me like that. Okay, I'm gonna taste this one. Much better. Hi, you guys. I'm with my channel. I'm gonna leave you guys, and I know already. Excuse my bed in the background. It's late, girl. So, um, 
what's going on it's late girl i'm starting this vlog real late it's 1 14 in the morning um <clears throat> but i just got home i uh worked so about 9 30 came home chill regroup got something to eat lay down for a little bit then got back up then i had to go take mari's dad her car seat because i still had it i was borrowing my friends because her cousin had my original car seat but i gave the other car seat back to my friend so i had to go bring her her car seat and now i'm just now getting home so yeah but it worked today girl i did a little bit of shopping i missed all the good sales like the good good sales was the day after christmas today was the okay sales like i got like the leftover bs but because i didn't think to go look yesterday but i look today i'm gonna show you what i got so so i went to bed Bath and Body Works. Sorry, I was late. Victoria's Secret and Cotton On. So I got one thing from Bath and Body Works and one thing from Victoria's Secret. So Victoria's Secret had a 50% off candle sale, but it was like all of the stanky candles. Like to be honest, the ones that no one wanted, y'all. They had a candle in there that smelled like bacon. Why would I want to light something to make my home smell like bacon? No. Then they had another one like called French something and that shit thing too but this one was on sale and this one was the best smelling one it's okay it's uh called toasted pineapple marshmallow i like it it has like a little bit of sweet it's like sweet but not like bakery sweet you know i like that one it's it's okay it's not like one of my faves but they had like more than one of these and i wasn't I wasn't down to buy more than one. Like, I was about to buy two, but I'm like, do I really want to spend $12? I don't think so. But, girl, y'all got this candle for $6. This is the cheapest I've ever gotten a candle at Bath Body Works. Now I went to Victoria's Secret to see, like, you know, what they had up in the air. They didn't have much because the location I worked at today, um, like the mall I worked at, their Victoria's Secret is going through some weird things where I think they're gonna change locations. So like, or I just got the last of the last, I don't know. But it looked very spacious in there. Like it's not much going on in that Victoria's Secret. So I don't know what that was about, but I got these slides. They just say uh, pink on them. That kind of got like a little bit of sticky stuff that needs to be wiped off, but whatever. These were like $10. And I just got these to just, you know, throw on when I'm going to get my feet done. Even though I don't like wait for my polish to dry or anything. What's this? Okay, period. But yeah, Victoria's Secret, when you go in there, the bras is still really good. But y'all want to know a secret? I only know the bras is good because of other people. I literally have never bought myself a Victoria's Secret bra. So I think it's time for me to grow the fuck up. I bought Walmart bras, y'all. They never failed me. But now I'm getting older and girl, I didn't have a kid. And even though I feel like my titties still sit the same after my kid because I didn't I didn't breastfeed that long. I breastfed for like three weeks. Then I had to get on this medication and force me to stop. So my titties didn't really go through that much when it came to ew. That's disgusting. My titties didn't really go through that much when it came to you know that. So they pretty much sit the same, but I'm losing weight. So like my my bras, like I don't know if y'all can see that, but it's like it be space. Like, it don't really give much support. Like, I feel like my titties just sit in my bra, but not really like, they don't support and sit them up, you know? So I need better bras, better bitches, better. Okay, so then I went to Cotton On, and I've never been to Cotton On. I always just look at, like, looked in there by passing by it, but I've never actually went in the store. But they had like a lot of $20, $5, $10 sales. And I said, let me just go see, because I'm in the process, you guys, let's talk. Let's talk because we ain't talk. I'm in a process, you guys, where like I'm revamping my wardrobe. Like anything I used to wear before I was pregnant, dead in that shit. Anything I wore while I was pregnant, dead in that shit. Like stuff don't even fit me the same. And I'm in a space where I'm learning to buy your true size so like what you're wearing can look the best on you. Like I feel like before I used to buy things that wasn't my size and made it work, but things look best when they actually fit you like stop trying to make it something else so i've come to that realization so i'm just trying to make buy things that fit my body like i'm losing weight a little bit like i'm not losing hella weight because i 
still feel that whatever but i know i'm losing weight because i know my clothes are fitting differently right so it's just time for me to just revamp myself like i'm coming into a new beach i'm coming into a whole new girl y'all my birthday is january 16th so my birthday is coming up so i'm gonna be 27 like ugh, i'm grown as fuck so yeah i'm just trying to revamp but that's besides the point. Just the stuff that I got is just, yeah, I just got like some basic stuff because, you know, you need those basics. So I got me some sweatpants because, girl, I never buy sweatpants. They're in this like baby blue. Let's see if I can get closer. I can really see the color. There you go. This baby blue grayish ash color. And these are really nice. They're really like, they're a nice kind of heavy material. I like the band on this and i have like this i have like this gray crop jacket that i can like make this make this a little set to like kind of a little monochromatic moment so yeah and it has a pocket on the back which is cute and it make my booty look good i got these in a size medium so they are already a loose fit it already it says on the tag a loose fit so i got a medium because i wanted to make my booty still look good but still be baggy on me but still fit like my waist and stuff and these fit perfectly these were ten dollars and they have other colors if they're still ten dollars tomorrow i think i may go get other colors just to say i got other colors because i have no sweatpants y'all like i just bought some black ones the other day and i finally got some like that well some another color because everything i have be tight and I don't always want to be tight. Sometimes you want to be comfortable. Like, bitch, stop being a house. And then I got this green corduroy skirt. Little mini skirt. I thought that this was so cute on when I tried it on. It was so cute. I should have filmed it. Like, I should have did a little try on for you guys. But maybe I'll do one. I don't know. We'll see. But when I tried it on, I thought it was so cute. Thought I could do a couple of different things with this. I like the pockets. I have an ass and I have thighs. But I'm not really a hippie girl. So stuff like this on the side really does give my illusion and have a little more hourglass figure than they actually do. So yeah, girl. And then I just got these two, these. And then I just got like this little basic top. I don't know what that says, but just a little basic top to just throw on, you know, with them sweatpants or with some jeans, just on a regular day, running errands, you know, type thing. Um, put on a jacket. And then I also got this. This was a very unique shirt to me. This isn't something I would usually buy, but I thought that was really cute. I have a lot of colors in here to play off of. You know, I have a lot of different ways that I can style this. And I wanna start playing with my style more because I don't really know what my style is. I honestly hate the way I dress. Like, that's why I'm not really active on Instagram because I'm just figuring myself out. So I don't even know what I like anymore. Like when it comes to clothes, I don't know what I like. I don't know how to dress. I don't know what's my style. But I saw this and I thought that it was cute. And I was like, you can, you know, you can get creative. I can, you know, either be basic with it or have fun with it. So this was just a little piece that I bought to just, you know, push me. And this was $5. This was $5. The skirt was 10 The pants was 10 So yeah they had like this leather green skirt too that i thought was kind of cute but i think that the corduroy one fit cuter so yeah that's what i got today when i went shopping it, it felt really good to you know just do a little sale shopping buy myself some money on h and m because they got the stuff too but i'm very pleased with my purchases like i'm very happy i felt very good and to know i got them two coupons just really made me even happier but um yeah so you guys i'm about to take my makeup off oh it fell on the floor and i don't see it right now but i even got me some uh, more oh it's right here i got me a little mini things of my origins checks and balances because i'm out the big bottle was 26 dollars. this was 15 it probably was stupid to buy this but in my eyes the big bottle was 30 dollars and this was 15 so i saved 15 dollars even though this is going to run out. Whatever. I wasn't prepared to pay $30 for the cleanser today. So I got a little one. Because it's just. I just didn't want to. <laughs> so yeah. Um, what was I going to say? Yeah. I'm going to take my makeup off. Um, wash my face. I got a half a burrito in there from the taco truck. So I'm going to chow down that motherfucker. And lay down. Get some rest. Because it's pushing 2 in the morning. Um get some rest and wake up in the morning go to the gym and i have to work tomorrow too so but i, I work late i work at 2 30 so i'm gonna go to the gym for sure in the morning before i go work out i mean before i go to work um 
So yeah, that's why I want to try to hurry up, get myself together so I can go to bed um, and get ready for tomorrow. So I will probably see you guys tomorrow.